about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking, we'll get away Good morning! We are currently running She's briskly walking And now, so am I I'm too out of shape for this stuff We actually are getting ready to go to uh, a play today Zar oh, Zarya's turn is in Beauty and the Beast so We are going to go do that right now Let me talk to you when I get in the car you ready? So I'm ready. We're going right there to Uptown. Huh? I'm gonna hold your hand. You're a big girl, come on. You wanna hold the tickets? Okay, let's follow sister. You want mommy to take the tickets? Wait, no, Nicole, you will walk. Come on, Zara. Life with no distractions, we'll get away. This is what we waited for. Take my hand, we'll make it somehow. We can't miss out. I'm done living life with the lights out. Okay, guys, we made it in, so I'm gonna turn this off because we can't have this on. But when we leave, me and the girls are gonna go grab a bite to eat. So I have to get her packed, her flight leaves. <sighs> like at nine or something. But we need to be at the airport at seven because she's flying alone. So we gotta be there two hours early. But, Hi. Zoe? No. Oh God, and this is our first time bringing Zoe, yes. Zoe to a place like this, so I don't know how this is gonna go. Get up here and sit down. Say something to everybody. Say hi, everybody. Hi, boy. Hi. What's your name? What's your name? Tell me your name. What's your name? Say Zoe. <laughs> Sick. Hmm? So Zoe and I left the play early because. Check out for Zoe. Oh look, they got check out for you. Let's go check out. Ooh, are you hot? I know it is super hot. Woo! So Zoe and I left the play early. You think we left the play early? Okay, early. Yeah, you left early. What happened? Okay, What's wrong with you? Mom. Yeah. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Yeah, she has an upper, upper respiratory infection. They had to do like a swab to make sure she didn't have strep throat. They checked her ears, no, no ear infection. They gave her an x-ray. She does have inflammation in her lungs, but no fluid, so that's really good. But they put her on a steroid and gave her a stronger um, antibiotic. So we're gonna go do that. And I still have to go home and get Zaria completely packed. Charles is doing it for me now, but I'm just so scared that he is not gonna have everything packed up. I'm gonna trust in him because he knows how like anxious I get when I feel like um, time is not on my side. I get super duper anxious and it always works out. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna work out fine, but I don't know. And then I found out that I may not be able to go with Zaria to the airport or through the airport because she's 12 and on Southwest, minors 11 and under you can like get a escort pass and escort them back and stay on the plane with them and stay on the plane with them and everything but honey they said that she's 12 so if she's not like she's no longer an unaccompanied minor so she's gonna have to fly independently so we'll see what happens when i get there i'm definitely still gonna try to go through and go back there with her <laughs> but i don't know so let's go get this girl some medication and get zaria packed up i have to leave for in two hours to take zaria to the airport so let's go let's go i'm so tired y'all i'm so tired but whatever let's go you nervous Very. why i'm fine by myself you got this girl and they might not let you go back i know we'll find out though 
So what do you mean? Like, they won't let you go back past TSA? Um, probably not. We'll find out when we get there, though. We will find out when we get there. All right, y'all. So we're getting ready to take, well, I am getting ready to take Zaria to the airport. My dad is supposed to be coming, but we have to leave in seven minutes for me to get there in time. Um, but Zaria is nervous because she might not get to go. I might not get to go back there with her like I thought and sit with her until the plane takes off. How do you feel about that? Nervous. I ain't nervous. Well, because I want to be by myself. No one's going to be with me. And like... I don't know. I'm I'm an awkward child. I don't know what to do. You're not awkward. You'll be fine. Okay? Like I told y'all before in the last vlog, I never had her fly before on the airplane by herself. She's flown with us multiple times, but not on the airplane by herself. Not as an unaccompanied minor because I didn't want to pay the extra fee both ways. Um, but now she's 12, and so she is too old to be an unaccompanied minor, and I can't even pay the fee for her to like be able to fly with assistance. Um, and I just found out today that I may not be able to go back there with her. So we're just going to see what happens when we get to the airport. Um, so yeah, let's go to the airport. You're going to be fine. Okay. Okay. What did I tell you to do when you got there? I have to t take off my shoes, take out my passport and my phone mm -hmm. and go through TSA. Then when I get up there to like my gate, I have to, um, as soon as they call for A, I go up there. And I try to get in front. Yeah. So we, we pay for like the early bird check and stuff so she can make sure she gets a decent seat towards the front of the plane. Um, and then so we don't have to be waiting. She doesn't have to be waiting um, for a long time to get on because she is only traveling with the carry on. I'm scared. Don't be scared, baby. Okay. You got this, okay? Oh, I'm pretty. Oh, yes, you are. I'm with my own doubts. Nervous. Okay. You got this, okay? Okay. Seen a couple of kids by themselves. So you should be good to go. Because if somebody touch you and you don't know them, you start screaming your I head off. I told you that you start screaming your head off. It's dad. Say hi, daddy. Hey, y'all. Uh... <laughs> dad came down here with me to drive Zaria off at the airport. Charles is at home with Zoe because y'all know she got sick, so he can't come. He had to stay home with her. <sighs> Let's get her taken care of. And you're not the only one flying by yourself. Look, I, I look, see, I don't know. They're probably, she's probably flying with her daughter. It's all right, you got this. Okay. It looks like there are a lot of kids that are flying by themselves right now, though. Because she don't know if she's going nowhere. Yeah. That lady right there, girl. Let her right there. It's okay. Look, these babies aren't, he's not nervous. Okay, we got Zari all checked in. We um, were able to get an escort pass to go back there with her. Yay! So me and my dad are gonna go back with Zaria. She's nervous, but the good thing is, Zaria, we stay with you until you're plane late. At least until you're bored. Okay. Okay, so let's go through TSA and get going. Made it through TSA. Dad's put on his shoes. All right, Zaria made it through the first part. It's a, it. Got that, all right, let's go. Gate 10, did we say gate 10? Yes. All right, got my escort pass. When you get off of the airplane, you need to go look up and look at baggage claim and you just follow the arrows. Okay. Okay? But I guarantee you, most people are gonna be going to baggage claim anyway. All right? Isn't that too right here? Where? Oh, dad. What else are you gonna get? I've been really into wheat bread lately. 
what's in it. It's just wheat bread. It is ham, fish, cheese, fish, cheese, and wheat. Ten dollars. Okay, a gentleman sandwich. Come on. Yeah. You can get that if you want. That's fine. Is that all you want? Is that it? All right. Uh, look, nineteen dollars and eighty-one cents for that airport food. Kids get you all the time. Thank you. Can you have, you have a bag? Get your bag, baby. Right here, baby. Sorry, right here. On this side. Ready? Nervous? Okay. Twenty-three. Okay. So let's go. Yeah. You nervous? Yeah. No, no nerves. You already said you found somebody that would help you through. Yes. Right. So they said that um, once we landed, they would help me through a shuttle and help me get the baggage claim and stuff. But our chair is going to be there, so you don't want to get on the plane with you. <laughs> I can't. I wish I could, though. Give me a hug. I love you, baby. Mwah. Mwah. You have a good flight. Thank you. I love you. Call me when you land. Okay. Get your phone out. Bye, baby. I love you. <laughs> I hope she don't sit in the back of the plane. I told her to go in the front and get a window seat. So let's hope that she did that. Okay, so that was, oh look. Already FaceTiming me. Did you get a window seat? Huh? Why are you in the middle? You told you could put, it, put your earbud on. Okay, so this isn't working, so I'm just gonna text her. Do we have any available extra time? Stand by boarding pass, extra time, and those aliens prefer. Now boarding family boarding, you have small children, six and under, and active in the military with ID. She said, I sat next to someone. I said, why are you in the middle? And she said I was in good hands. I said, okay, that's good. Are you next to a man? No, both women. Thank God. That's what I'm talking about. I said, thank God. Whew. Okay, guys. Y'all, my brows are always so thick. I can get it off. Anyway, guys, Zaria dropped off at the airport. I just want to wash my hair. Well, actually, she's done. She dropped off at the airport. She lands in like another hour in Atlanta. So everything was a success. She was super nervous, but luckily she met like a group of women who took care of her. And as y'all saw on the FaceTime call, she's sitting between two women. So I was like, okay, yes. But um, I need to wash my hair, honey. It is so dirty and so shrunk. And I look like a freaking... I don't know what it looked like. But anyway, hope y'all enjoyed today's vlog. I know it was all over the place. But um that's it. Okay. If you're not subscribed to our channel, go ahead and do so. Hit that subscribe button and then hit your notification bell so you can be notified when I do upload. Y'all, in the meantime, in between time to the next time. Bye. With the lights out, die with my own doubt.